In this video, we are going to be showing you how to check the rarity of any NFT that is currently on OpenSea. Now, any NFT that the whole collection is actually on OpenSea, this won't necessarily work for NFT projects that are currently minting or are up and coming. So once a mint cycle is completely done and the collection is on OpenSea, you can then use this to go and check. So the first thing we're going to do is let's go ahead and just grab an NFT collection. Uh, we'll do this, uh, Crypto Pills. Now this is good for one of two things. If you're out there trying to snipe NFTs and get a good price, if you find a really rare NFT and that seller does not know the rarity of their NFT, they might sell it for a lot less than it's actually worth. And this is something that people are using to make a ton of money flipping these extremely rare NFTs that are very, very undervalued or underpriced. Now the second thing is, if you actually want to make sure that you're pricing your NFT out to the correct valuation then you actually need to know how rare it is and there is a tool that will tell you exactly how rare it is and how rare it is in comparison to the rest of the nft collection so this is uh crypto pills by micah klein i believe i said that right and we're just going to go ahead and grab one let's go to buy now and let me grab keyboard here so we can see this crypto pills number 3276 is currently selling for 0.23 ethereum now one of the ways you can see rarity is just going to the properties and saying okay this is a nine trait nft and like the skateboard is a one percent rarity and that's all fine and well but if you want to dive even deeper what you can do is you can go to rarity.tools this is a website that will show you the rarity of of your NFTs and all you have to do is go up to all collections and then we're gonna search crypto pills uh, maybe there is a crypto pills there we go and we can see by volume crypto pills is the 83rd ranked uh, top selling NFT project right now now you can see all the rated rarities here and this is a good way to snipe these as well you can just go to the home page of any of these projects and once you're at the home page you can sort through and if they are listed for sale you can see the price right down below of course if you see something on the first page that is one ethereum or less then you know you have a pretty good shot at flipping that and making some good money. Now once you're actually on the page, uh, the Rarity Tools page, you're going to go up to the top left where it says ID. Now the ID is going to be the mint number. And if there is no mint number, you can always go down to details and the token ID will be right there. All you have to do is copy that token, token ID, plug it into Rarity Tools and click look up. And you will get a Rarity score based on whatever you put in so we can see that this rarity rank is number 8934 that means out of a 10,000 collection this is rank number 8934 now what we can do is we can go to the next one and say okay well that is 0.238 ethereum or about nine hundred dollars and it's rank 8900 not very good if we go to this one which is 0.24, only about $20 more, and we say, okay, number 8548, uh, let's go back to Rarity Tools, 8548, and we look that up, we can see, wow, well, this is 4,000 ranks rarer. So this is really helpful when, if you spend 0.01 Ethereum more, you're getting something that is valued 4,000 ranks higher. And you can go through any collection that is fully minted on OpenSea and do this. So why would you spend the same amount of money or more money for something that is a lot less rare when you can just plug it into Rarity Tools and buy something that is far more valuable for the same price. So that's Rarity Tools. If you guys found this helpful, make sure to thumbs up the video and subscribe. We have a ton more content coming out from flipping NFTs to creating NFTs to really anything NFT news in the NFT space. Again, if you found it helpful, hit that subscribe button and we're going to be making daily content for you.